feels good um i'm just working hard i'm not really focusing on that like i'm not like making that like an accomplishment i'm just building off small wins and just working hard uh, i'm pretty smooth i got like a couple different styles that i'll be on but i'm real honest and i'm straightforward so um you know it's just hip-hop Yeah, yeah, I'm chilling right now. Um, I'm building off what we've already, what we already got, the platform that we already built for ourselves, and I'm um, just being real in tune with the fans. And right now, why you know why we got the momentum and everything's moving forward, it just doesn't make sense right now. So um, you know, I think it's best for me right now. So I'm chilling. Yeah, just the creative, just having creative control and just, you know, the team being small, everything not being all over the place. I pretty much know everything that's going on with Dizzy Wright. I live in Vegas, he lives in California. And we've just been doing a lot of touring over the last year since I've been signed to Funk Volume. And um, since then I've just been working like on my own music and he's been doing his own thing. So I haven't really got the vibe with him in that studio setting yet, you know, just like, cause we got a lot going on, but the chemistry is cool. Like, you know, Hop's a cool dude, like he has his own lane. And um, he's a great performer and a great artist and he's a character, like, <laughs> you know, but it's been cool. Yeah, the Golden Age mixtape is what I got coming next. It's um, it's pretty cool. It's just like I've already been on it, but I'm pretty much just making a bit a mixtape based around it. Just substance, man. July, sometime in July for sure. Um, yeah, I got my homie uh, Kid Ink on there. I got my homegirl Honey Cocaine on there. Um, you know I'm gonna have a funk vibe family on there. I'm not trying to get ahead of myself or like, you know, set those kind of goals for myself because, you know, that's out of my reach, you know, but I just want to make great music and keep doing that and I feel like if I just keep doing that, it will slowly grow. Did you see that Miguel leg drop? What are your thoughts on that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I could not believe it. I was, what's funny is I was, cause I was watching it live, you know, I was watching it live. I had just, I just got on it. He was killing that shit. He was killing it. I was like, ooh wee, like he killing it. And then like, I don't know what the fuck he was trying to do. Like he just like Ray Mysterio the girl. And it was just, <laughs> It was crazy, like, but I think he was trying to jump into the splits or some shit. Stop he looked work. like he was trying to kill it. If he would have landed it, though, if he would have jumped over and landed it, he would have shut the show down. Because he was killing it. Absolutely. But yeah, he fucked up. He <laughs> fucked up. 